Hi, beautiful beings. So, light. This is Yana, and welcome to my um, platform here, uh, to my world. Okay, in the month of uh, March of 2023. Okay, so like uh we've been going through um again lots of purification right transformational energies inner healing you know, inner inner cry right so um that's kind of what i've been going on at, at the same time enjoying extremely powerful and um you know multi-dimensional omni omniverse energies or energies of the multiverse however you want to call it you know the cosmic energies coming they're coming here more and more right we're being inundated with those gamma rays frequencies and with those ascension codes even for healing for transformation to expanding our consciousness having now really uh, connection direct connection to to source and to your soul right start realizing who you truly are we came here to realize our soul to master our energies right here especially the uh, sexual energy the kundalini rising right i do um i've you know i've been doing lots of like a yoga meditation you know after um everything that happened to me because of the darpa the military right introducing um yoga um to um uh wounded warriors okay i got a i got a backlash right all these psychotronic uh weapons going on and uh, all these um kind of uh, astral wars going on astral terrorism from those astral organizations right um you know like hydra and octopus and uh, all this stuff um, but, you know, I keep my practice going, of course, we're here to hold the frequency vibration to, um, you know, helping this planet humanity with the transition, with the ascension, right? We're entering the new golden age in Aquarius. We are leaving the Kali Yuga and entering the Satya um, Yuga, the age of truth, okay? So um, anyway, so the morning practice and, you know, I usually work in the afternoon and um, so this is going to be a very important part right um again we're still in pisces march in pisces but well, like we're approaching the full moon um that's going to be in aquarius so it's going to be like the beginning and the end and the same time like feeling the spirituality right and at the same time like feeling the power of our soul i mean this is kind of how i feel it again this is all coming through my soul signature energy signature only take what resonates with you and leave the rest but we are freeing ourselves from that matrix, you know, freeing ourselves from DARPA, right? Or three letter agencies, you know, from, from all these corporations as re really their matrix is collapsing. Their AI is, um, you know, uh, it's got, it looks like lots of glitches and, um, you know, with the energy work and um, with the, that's the, the grid work and, um, you know, all these gatekeepers and, you know, I have the ascension uh, glossary going on and actually all this information the newsletters from Lisa Renee right energetic synthesis um, the Orion belt pretty much has been uh, freed there are three main stars uh, Mintaka Alni Alnitak, Alnilam, you know, and so we are resurrecting the threefold founder flame, right? You know, the 15th dimension, even, um, you know, the violet flame was running reversals, but, you know, this is all being corrected. And so we are kind of the correction team, you know, we make sure everything is running um, uh, proper codes, everything is now going right side up, right? Um, uh, we have the Christic, Christic spiral based 12 mathematics, right? The Trinity um, and uh, the proper symmetry, geometry, because here this matrix was running on that reversal, reversal Nephilim grid, right? With all these, um, you know, hybrid, you know, Anunnaki or the Hyksos and, you know, the Illuminati, the Cabal. And, you know, they have their astral organizations and they have highly advanced technologies and, some of them, what we see actually on a physical world, they're nothing but puppet of those negative aliens. And that's, you know, what we are dealing, the indigo warriors, right? I mean, you know, in the astral planes, high, high densities, you know, because, you know, they have spaceships, spacecraft, they have AI running through their brain or they have super quantum computers, right? Um on their um, on their fleet so uh this kind of um i didn't even realize you know it just kind of happened you know at me growing up in eastern europe i know that i was uh, being contacted by you know interesting very benevolent et force uh, forces and they were asking me all kinds of questions and now i'm realizing that i had to be the arsha command you know our star actually personally okay um but, you know with the star seeds coming from uh, volunteer souls coming from extremely high dimensions and making sure 
sh yeah, making sure the as ascension is happening, right? And of course, the connection to the solar Rishi. So, um, you know, there are many levels of ourselves. There are also many levels and dimension even of the Ashta command. So again, on my website, Yanakalai, you can read again, only take what resonates with you and leave the rest. But you know what the Ashta command represents, you know, and um, I know that Ashta works uh, with ascended masters, uh, especially Yahshua, right? We know him as uh, Jesus, but you know, he's commander Sananda. And, you know, remember he's um, already, um, he already been uh, here and ascended, right? Right? So he's running the base 12 mathematics. He's got the 12 strands of DNA being embodied. And, you know, the Pleiadians, because we're dealing with Pleiadians, 5D, 7D. I mean, we're helping humanity, right? Because the, the, there was a three seedings of humanity. I think that was in even in Pleiades. But uh, we are running... Um, uh, those who are the Orafim races, the Christos founder races, divine architects, right? Um, we already running the... Um, the diamond sun dna you know base 12 mathematic structure some of them even 24 strands of dna 36 uh, strands of dna and 48 strands of dna so that would be azurites right so we're going really the uh, to the back to the original the ancient of the ancients lots of these elders right the energies or they, they, we can feel their energies some of them they can incarnate, you know, they can materialize, dematerialize, like, you know, Mahatavar Baba, uh, Baba Ji, or, you know, I work with the energies of Satya Sai Baba as well, uh, the Maharishi energy and the, the Ashta command. So again, only take what resonates with you, leave the rest. Very important, guys. Uh, yeah, there was the Ashta command, what it represents, right? Where is the mission, actually? My mission also, like, healing um, the veterans and especially my soul group ended up in um, terroristic organizations, right? Those are indigo warriors. Uh, those are the souls from Tara, right? That was the second density. That's the four, five, and six dimensions. They ended up, you know, MC, right? Marine Corps. Um, they're running um, the Pluto uh, or the Saturnian, um, you know, uh, lunar matrix, uh, matrix um, that was the base 10 mathematics, right? They were their anti-life, anti-Christ, anti-human code, agenda 2030, and so on. So we are helping them to rehabilitate their DNA, to deprogram, you know, because uh, they had AI running through their brain you know of course you know uh we're putting everything into divine justice you know d-a-r-p-a -A, right uh, right this uh, responsible for all that three letter agencies you know and all these corporations ha hiding heinous crimes against humanity the planet and of course star seeds you know so everything was pretty much reversed um you know when they were saying oh we we are uh, counteracting terrorism and it's actually uh, the bad guys the bad aliens they are killing uh, killing um, you know star seeds and um, you know indigo races and the Essenes and of course humanity the angelic humans because we have the diamond sun DNA uh, the aliens you know they have regressed there those who are regressed or master raider races or Hyksos you can see them even you know, the World Half Organization or Economic Forum, you can see them behind the conference desk, you know, they're the hybrid Anunnaki Draconians and they, they're running the base in mathematics and uh, their blueprint of DNA has been pretty much damaged, you know, they have, they, they depend on AI, the AI running the reversals and they have, um, you know, DNA with black holes, they're like a black goo, you know, they hardly, their chakra aura energy field to me is very, uh, you know, very dark and some of them don't even have a heart or don't even have a soul, right? The Anubis heart, you can again Google an Ascension Glossary Lisa Rene. And so again, my, it's, uh, you know, my videos are not for everybody, advanced souls and, you know, who've been, like I said, we are freeing, um, you know, those beautiful souls, even from Melchizedek lineages, right? Who ended up, you know, in skull and bones and uh, in the, you know, so-called the Mas Masonic kind of uh, structures um, with satanic ritual abuses, you know, uh, sodomy black magic witchcrafting pedophilia child sex trafficking and all this kind of stuff so we also have like a medical team and you know the technology is pretty much here because here we go like i mentioned at the beginning right what happened to me the psychotronic weapons you know all this torture that i had to go through on that physical but mostly on the astral plane right and they um uh, what's the word for it? they um, uh, name me like I, you know, I have a schizophrenia you know that's how they are destroying those who are helping actually humanity with ascension so I pretty much even understand the trial of yeah uh, was the lawyer Murdoch you know you know it's there there's guys so much going on that people see here on that 3d 4d level you have to be really highly evolved 
Uh, but what I wanted to say, this body is, you know, talking, walking, and so on, even though it's been terrorized, been so damaged. So we have the AI technology of the positive faction that recognizes the heart structure and, you know, the super mind technology, right? Helping, uh, helping the super soldiers get them back on track. Of course, those who can still be helped because some of them, you know, when you, uh, you the soul uh, completely leaves the body, uh, leaves the body and you're nothing but a drone or clone, you know, robot, you know, of course, you know, there's a medical team out there and we're taking care of the soul. Uh, but, you know, the agenda of the negative ones emerging humanity with AI, right? The transhumanism and also transgenderism. They're using all kinds of uh, hormones hormonal therapies and so on so you guys you know you have to take care of yourself you know there's no other way just taking care of yourself just doing the spiritual spiritual work and um I guess, you know, that's, you know, that's what I'm here. We are holding the frequency vibration for all this craziness that now it's transpiring and people are seeing for what it is, but they're in interpreting only through, you know, their level of consciousness for us. You know, it's not judgment. It is extremely low. They don't understand the energy structure. Anunnaki, you know, there's our 11 dimensional beings, the fallen angelics, right? Then we have the Dracos, Draconians. Those are 10 dimensional beings. So, you know, we are doing the triple, quadruple work, right? Now, even the 24 dimensional uh been opened here right we have the cosmic portals opening guys so the new earth ascension grid extremely important so making sure each and every day or each and every morning which each and every breath you're connecting to that new earth and what are you creating right you're asking yourself each and every day who am i why did i come here to this planet what is my mission gifts and talents that's how you also start reverberating the quantum financial system for yourself where you'll be helped and um you'll be uh, supported right by the galactics that's why the galactic codex guys the new earth jurisdiction very important to study that embody that understand that also understanding the 13 principles right 13 principles of natural laws law of one because that's what we are running right, uh, right now the base 12 mathematics the law of one right like the arsha command uh, we are all now under the universal um, uh, uh, laws, the cosmic sovereign law, okay? And uh, because the bad guys, the negative ones, right? They were running the law of reversals, right? For example, I, I would be told, right, that I am the bad guy, right? But it's now all about frequency vibration. What are you surrendering with? And also, if they, you know, they're doing surveillance. Like, what, what are you buying, right? Me, organic fruits and vegetables. You know, I live very simply. I only work kind of part-time now in a restaurant okay and uh, you know so there is so much proof who really i am i do have um certification as a yoga instructor i used to be a massage therapist i did ayurvedic massages i, I do ayurveda cooking right and uh compared to those who were um, um trying to eliminate this body and did all this damage and destruction it's going to um cosmic trials right look how what, what's their lifestyle pedophilia pornography drinking adrenochrome i drink pure uh, water okay uh so th this is now going to be proved on that physical plane but of course you know in those higher dimensions i work with the solar rishi the ashta command the ascended masters right and you know the pleiadians of course the ecturians the dromedans of course the the crystal star family guys unity vow you can also find it on my website yanakalai.com you know, we're the true spiritual warriors, right? The defenders of truth, you know, and you know how it used to be in the middle of uh, medieval times, you know, the Holy Land, the Holy Israel, because now they created the proxy Israel, all these proxy wars, right? We are guarding, we're the guardians, we're guarding that uh, holy path to to the one, to the infinite one. And, you know, here in the physical plane, it was like the Israel, you know, and things like that. Um, so... You know, there are so many levels and dimensions and how I also I am um, transmitting the energies and what I'm talking about, guys, uh, you know, it's multidimensional, right? And it goes to extremely, extremely high dimensions, cosmic energies, right? Cosmic energy, Satya Sai Baba. So again, only uh, takes what resonates with you, leave the rest, whatever you're perceiving, how you're perceiving, it's, it's a mirror image of you, of your consciousness. And of course, you know, now we have the information. So very important now to be responsible for everything, right? What are your thoughts, feelings, and emotions? What are you putting out there? What kind of reality are you creating? I have the Guardian Ascension Protocol call for you guys listening 
to sulfidio tones, japa mantra meditation, right? Invoking uh, invocation of the violet flame, write things down, PTSD time to heal from Kathy O'Brien. She was a sex slave in a white house and look what she achieved. She healed herself and now she's doing wonderful work out there. Uh, very important talk about the shadow, um, the darkness, you know, I deal with the shadow government, especially, government, especially the shadow military abuse and misuse of highly advanced alien AI technology. Crucifixion implants, right? Like I was mentioning, guys, you know, you can find an ascension glossary and that's what is happening. If you want to become a Marine or super soldier, or that's they were trying to make a super Marine out of me, initiation, Mason, 33 degree and all this kind of stuff. And here we go. No, thank you. Right. We're transforming all that. So, you know, I was supposed to be uh, their slave, their puppet, their assassin. And uh, it's all going to divine justice because uh, even though, uh, you know, even though, you know, I'm dealing with my cell group and uh, also with the um, Rothschilds and I'm dealing um, uh, with the power elite, right? And I have um, kind of the same DNA. I've come from that same DNA lineage as well. You know, those, the alien hybridization, that's what happens. All these mutation, DNA mutation, alien hybridization. So pretty much all of us, you know, most of us have reptilian DNA or draco draconian DNA or Anunnaki. You know, I, I Anunnaki DNA, I know that my dad, he was always regarded as some weird, like being weird, even my grandfather you know with rh negative you know i i do identify uh, myself more with et and you know with extraterrestrials and with the holy spirit in you know, christ than with the physical body and how you look and uh, you know this material consumerist kind of world and uh, even like the money structure i don't understand because here in the matrix you know they were running you know uh, the babylonian empire the sex magic money magic you know all this slavery and, and so on so we're exposing all that or it's actually through all these gamma rays frequencies everything's being exposed it's coming right in front of our faces and it's like how we are dealing with it are we reacting are we shocked are we scared or like, thank you for showing me this. It's been hidden for so long. And now people are saying, you know, all the, you know, that America is under threat. You guys, this has been going on for hundreds, hundreds and thousands of years. And because, you know, all the invasion and, you know, the alien invasion and uh, the uh, invasion of the Egypt and you have the Luciferian covenant and all these cataclysm. And then they were building the Nephilim the reversal grids. And, you know, you had then the kind of the medieval times. And then you have all these crazy wars going on and World War One, World War Two. Right. And now we're with this AI World War Three kind of going on, the cybernetic surveillance and all this stuff guys this is nothing new under the sun like the cloning and the spaceship spacecrafts because we used to have uh, ancient civilizations there were other golden ages right lemurian in lemuria atlantis and uh, you know who knows what else you know with ets they were beautiful um uh, spaceships uh, hovering above uh, the cities or the villages and you know those ETs coming down here to those villages and teaching uh, people of the earth you know um, astronomy mathematics agriculture sacred geometry chanting sac sacred uh, ceremonies and now the bad aliens of course they come with their AI AI God right God mind algorithm god of all things and then they were reversing everything so and of course and the, the breeding right was happening uh with women so you know we do have that kind of inner struggle you know the word jihad right um it's, uh, you know from the islamic world you know you can kind of implement that so we have to transform transmute that in a war within ourselves so we can shine again and be the light a column of light shining bright and here be of service because that's to me only way how to get out from that matrix from that craziness right to understand the ascension protocol the ascension mechanics you know and i have all the tools for you guys to study and uh, you start implementing those tools and start walking those energies of love and faith and trust and grace and gratitude and compassion so important to be grateful and thankful for everything and it's just then it's a miracle like there's this upliftment that is coming uh from uh inside of you, you 
you know what I'm saying? And then you know how you're expanding the consciousness and how you're sharing that beautiful light with others. It has the ripple effect and that's what we're doing, right? Instead of the surveillance grid and the smart cities, we are now the new earth grid, right? The new, um, that's the essential new earth grid and just we're like the beautiful stars lighting up, lighting up the sky, right? And we're now meeting each other and, and sending love to each other and supporting each other and caring for each other. And that's the new earth here coming online right here, right now with ancient healing technology. Also technology that helping us to heal the planet, heal the world, cleanse the ocean, the um the soil, the air, and our food, right? Because the, you know, GMO, the toxins, the poison, the fluoride, all kinds of horrible chemicals, and this boom, 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 right? Things like that. So you guys, this is how we're making this uh, world a better place. This is how we are co-creating with the divine, this new earth that is rebirthing right here in front of our eyes, right? It's like our child, re re uh, our child, inner child is being reborn as well. So everything is interconnected. Everything flows. Everything now is coming to this oneness, to this harmony, to this beautiful balance, right? Yin and yang, divine feminine with a divine masculine merging together and birthing this new earth so my beloveds hope you're doing well i continue next time many blessings and namaste bye, -bye.